Oh, oh, look at snowing again. Oh, no. Well, here's what I did this week. I get angry about some guy parked my car and two chicks kiss each other. Pretty sweet. Check it out. <laughs> I'm the laziest outback in the world. That's true. Uh, oh my god, are you going to put this up? Yeah, because I told him to put us on the vlog. <laughs> no, you're not. Are you happy? Oh, uh, crazy face. I used to do a crazy face. Now you have to kiss my cheek. Yeah, oh wow. Thanks. Okay, I'm done. So it's Friday night. It's about 10 minutes to midnight. And I just got home from work, you know, there all day. And then some fucking asshole is in my fucking parking spot. What? Tell me, tell me what you don't get about this sign here. What? What part of that do you not understand? That means you can't park there. It's typical stuff. That means you can't park there because someone pays for that spot. Now I live in the, I live in a pretty expensive part of town. The reason it's so expensive is because it's so convenient to live here. Uh, I got the university right across the street from my apartment. I'm next to all the restaurants, all the bars, all the fun places to be, all the fun things to do on the weekend. And I pay good money to be able to park in my spot. And there's signs everywhere. There's one that's, when you come into the thing, there's a sign that says no parking. Every single sign says a spot. There's numbers, and I don't know why people park there. You're dumb. I'm going to tell you. The guy's on his way. And, uh, hope you learned your lesson, asshole. So I was almost feel bad for that guy last night, but in the same principle, there's, you know, there's 15 signs that say, you know, you don't park here, get someone else's spot. There was uh, one time that my car got towed because I parked, there's like, there's like a parking structure underneath the building, I was hanging out with a buddy of mine, and uh, my, my car got towed because I parked in someone else's spot, and I was, you know, just cursing this guy up and down, you know, call him every sort of four-letter word I could think of. And then, uh, you know, after I did that, I thought, well, there's a sign say, you know, this isn't your spot, dumbass, don't work here. So, hopefully that guy learned his lesson. Uh, I had a tow guy, like, I don't know, I was about months ago by now, and I told a, uh, I don't know, a buddy of mine, or not really a buddy, but like an acquaintance, like the story of how I had to have this guy's car towed. He goes, Oh, you're an asshole. Why would you tell somebody's car out of your parking spot? I'm like, Because it's mine. I pay money to park there. Therefore, it's mine. So if somebody else is there, they're not supposed to be there and they need to move. He goes, Oh, you're just a jerk. That's going to cost you a lot of money. I'm like, Well, yeah. Well, there's, there's signs so they don't park here. And I you know, said to him, like, oh, how'd you feel if you uh, walked into your house or apartment or whatever it was, and there's some guy just chilling on your bed? He goes, well, that means that I, I tell him to get out. I'm like, why? He goes, well, it's because it's my apartment. Oh, it's my parking spot. I pay money to park there. Kind of like you pay money for your house or apartment, wherever you live. And if some guy was just chilling on your bed, you'd be pretty pissed off, too, wouldn't you? Uh, yeah, I guess I'd be kind of mad. Same principle. That parking spot is my car's bed. That's where he liked to sleep. So anyway, that's my that's my three minute range about don't park in my parking spot. So don't do it.